Hello and welcome to Death Wish Gamer. I'm your host, Drethel12, and we're here to play some more RimWorld. <clears throat> the Analogy DLC. And last, before our last episode, we had just dealt with a, a uh, an attack, a raid, and we survived by using the animals to attack our enemies for us. That worked out pretty well for us. Unfortunately, I had, um, there were some fireworks going off. Scared a kitten into the truck of our neighbors, and we had to go help him out. And now, uh, today I've been dealing with trying to get this kitten to learn how to eat baby formula, or kitten formula. So, that was quite a bit. We had to wait till he was really hungry before he would even accept it. That was my day. You see Benita here. She's going to go ahead and capture this one. Hope everybody's weekend's going all right. Wait, is the rhino out too? Oh, it's dead too. Oh yeah, someone asked, they wanted to see what my ideology was for this run. So he wanted to duplicate it, so if you're there, you can watch it here. This is our Vixology, as I call it. This uh, narrative is something written by Verotech, one of my viewers. We just decided to stick with it. We also start with the animalist style, art style, or architecture style. Um, with the embodied theist, as we believe gods walk the earth, and we're going to nominate one lucky fox to become the fox god, but that's a long story. Anyways, pause it if you want to, you know, capture this or screenshot it. And, yeah, these are, it's pretty basic. It is a f uh, fluid uh, ideology, so you can add to it over time. So it's not very complex. So right now it just has what's the it has collectivist as our meme. And depending on what we do in game, we'll add more to it. So that's that. Oh, we have the tri third trimester for Nicola. You better start getting ready for the that arrival. In fact, we're probably gonna have two cat. I mean, two cats, two kids to prepare for. Bonsai is not doing too well. And he should be fine up to that. Oh yeah, we captured that guy. So let's go ahead and put him in convert. this I'm gonna have him hit this guy with that uh, we can't really have I mean she, she if she eats the last of the side shites well I mean we can s harvest this soon so I guess it's not too bad big of a deal not ideal though. Fortunately, the. 
Where, where is she going? She went all the way for that. Well, she can't eat insect jelly, so she won't get herself beaten up by insects. This guy's still sleeping. Is anybody tend to him? Like, just cook already. So we're still working on the bridge. We're going to lay it with traps before we complete it, though. And after we get the, the bridge completed, we're going to put a wall across the other, you know, the river so that people have to cross at the bridge. Because this part, this is like the shortest part right here. So people will probably try to cross here as well. We definitely want to put start with the wall here. Unfortunately, we might have to use like wood and bridges to, for this little part here. Alright, looks like we're done with the food. I noticed that they changed the art of the construction blocks. Give a little faded effect in the corners. Oh no, the elephant expired. There's lots of food that we can eat though, so... <clears throat> we have time. But we're going to be out of that side shite soon. We're going to start feeding the bodies to these trees. Okay, she's done. After she drank the last of the, the tea, She's done going to uh, mental breakdown. Void curiosity. Vera has begun to fixate on the void and wishes to investigate it using the void provocation ritual. Use the void provocation ritual to discover it and capture entities. Captured entities can be studied to complete anomaly research projects or connected to a biophorite harvester to generate biofluorite. Place a psychic ritual spot to perform the void provocation ritual. Let's see here. We just put it there, I guess. We're still kind of recovering, though. Everybody's mood is better. I'm gonna hit this guy with the convert now. Is anybody tended to him? Okay. Marriage is on. So have time on the rhinos. It's a good chunk. Alright. 
How's researching horrors beyond human comprehension going? Oh, it is without its uh, difficulties for sure. I mean, it is with its own set of difficulties. But so far, it's been rather interesting. Leave that there. Would it eat rotten? Oh, it will eat rotten bodies. Well, if it will take rotten bodies... Hmm. Hey, Lucy, what's up? Just want to do some more Rimworld fun. Mm, that's the last of the medicine. people their own beds now. Made purely out of elephant hide. I think people should clean. This place is awful. How are we on wood? Alright, we have 15 blocks left. Those are the shamblers, I think. There's the shard. This guy died. <laughs> How morbid. It's just a... Oh my god, it just spews blood out. Crazy. She's still cleaning? Wow. Place was that dirty. Alright, we're gonna have to just chop them. What do you have chained in the shed next to your base? Also, what is going outside going outside of your base so these are holding spots for anomalies these are let's see here where's the codex they're called sight stealers so that's what we're have chained up there you can research them for experience or a research Nine hundred wood. Let's see here. I want them to grab the guns. Have they grabbed the guns yet? I see them still out there. That one has nine hours left. Why is Vera unhappy? Oh, observed corpse. Ha! <laughs> 
That's a lot of meat. And we're at the third trimester from Benita. Grabbing that. We're gonna have to get used to looking at corpses. Entity escaped. They're like invisible creatures, I guess. Let's see, we'll let Edwin carry it back, but we're gonna have to put down that guy. Crisis of Faith. Oh, they switched. Well, that sucks. They switched to the one I didn't want them to go to. We saved the door. No, not the fox! It was the first time they escaped. Alright. No injuries to us, which is good. Insufficient containment. That one's will escape soon. But we don't have any electricity, which would help contain them. But it is what it is. Alright, they're getting the, the guns, the bolt actions. Let's see, we're gonna let the brown fox get the bolt action rifles. We're in the middle of hauling. Give you the auto pistol or the machine pistol. Kept the wrong weapon. Granite fell to the earth. You can get that action, bolt action rifle. There we go. So, of everybody, looks like Nicola's the only one that doesn't have a gun, so we're going to give her the auto pistol. Wait, that one's a normal one. We'll go with that instead.
we're gonna we're gonna add meat here because since we are overflowed with meat here it's really not going to do us any good keeping it for ourselves so we'll feed it to the plants because they will take just raw meat Alright, I'm going to start harvesting the Psychoid because someone drank all of it. I'm going to have to make some tea. Oh yeah, four is fine. Now we're going to take Nicola off construction so she can just do research because we're falling behind. I think we... I don't remember it looking like that. That's a weird skeleton. Anyways, let's go ahead and start expanding the bridge. grass I don't know what's going to happen if we keep feeding this thing But I will at least make use of the meat. Oh, let's get that out of there. Let's get bed ready for delivery. Shotgun instead. And the meat won't last much longer. What's out there? Boomalopes now. Party time. Just hanging out in the the front here. Ship to the stars. So last attack was around fifteen. It's been four days. Five days. The rhino meat's gone. Let's go ahead and get our level 3 ability for Nicola. Which I think 
Vertical pulse would be a good one. Oh, her convert's ready again. Set this guy up. And she got vertical pulse. Nice. Still working on him. Distress signal. You've intercepted the distress signal from a nearby camp of Union Missler. The frantic voice be begs for immediate assistance defending against the threats. They offer everything at their camp in return for help, including shards of powerful Arco technology. As the voice tries to explain the nature of the threat, the signal goes dead. Yuri. It's not far. Is it a quest? We have 15 days to deal with it. Hey, Green Blade. Oh, hey, just got there. Thanks for showing your ideology. Sure, no problem, man. Now, is our hunter hunting? He's just... Oh, yeah, because I put hauling as his primary function right now. Ooh, the food's out. is slowly reaching shore. Let's see here. At least we got some food. Fortunately, we have a ton of leather. I think maybe we should make, like, clothing at least out of it. this going See if this guy gets another. Oh, it's already down.
It's interesting that they've changed the lighting. It has a little glow to it now. Let's see, is it going to burn away? I don't think we can get to it in time. It's a shame that the rain can't put it out. That was a waste. Wood's starting to get low. Hey, Nick Burger, what's up? Oh, yeah. Um, why does it do that? The type of wear that we want is rhino and elephant. It is a pentagram of sorts. It's a ritual spot. At least we got enough food from one Bumalo. Shot in. Nice. Down to twelve. Is looking nasty in there. All right, one more talk. He should be converted. Let's see here. You can finish it now. Doing complex furniture right now. Guess we scared off the rest of the boom loops. Now that we have furniture, 
start putting the meat in a more confined area. But Bonsai is moving insanely fast. I think Bonsai has the uh, the Mechanites in him. Oh, here we go. Oh, they're not going to use the bed. Start cleaning. Oh my god. Alright, we're about to have the first birth. got a healthy child. It's a healthy little girl. Let's see, who do we not have here? We don't have Cryptia, which is rare. Alright. Oh, nice little blue tail there. Deep blue. Welcome to the rim. Got food poisoning. Now for the child, everybody's supposed to take care of it. So we're gonna make some baby food. And we're gonna add that here, baby. Another food poisoning. Not a good start. Oh, that was to the, the captive, so it's not a big deal. It's probably best for the elephant leather, or just some of it, to go away because we have too much of it. It's adding to the wealth that we just don't use. Let's see, is, uh, yeah, she can convert now. There we go. Converted, and now let's reduce his will. We got some baby food. We're upgrading our clothing. Temperature is not that great, so let's go ahead and put one of these passive coolers. Put him down.
Actually, let's go ahead and hit him with one of these. There we go. Get in there. Gum. It's an interesting rain sound. I don't think they had that before. Alright, pal. I'll let you cook before this meat expires. Wait, you use medicine on that guy? Hell, we got raids. Father of the town guard of town guard Fred Fredheim. Oh, that's his father. Okay, we get to kill him. What do we got here? Nine humans. Are they attacking now? Let's see here. A group of cultists from the servants of Horrocks have arrived nearby. They intend to use psychic rituals to summon hideous flesh beasts to attack you. They might perform the ritual multiple times. You need to get go stop them. There are people who have relationships with them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care about their relationships. Keep in mind that even though they are relatives, they will still attack each other. Okay. Cultists now. Interesting. Well... Let's see, I think Vera, are you pregnant? One of you are pregnant, yeah. So Bonita, you can stay behind for now because you're too slow. But everybody else, come with me. Bonita's working on the bridge. Flesh beasts. Wanderer joins. Joins. What? what? Lore keeper named Steve has arrived. Alright, I'll. Um, he's willing to contribute but will not leave willingly. Fine. Just a rando guy. We'll enslave him later. He's not addicted to beer, he just happens to have one. Here, grab that shotgun. And meet us out here. We could piss off the elephants and have them fight them. Oh, this guy's coming. That's a different hairstyle. I don't recall seeing that before. Yeah, it is a different hairstyle. I guess there's like a cultist hairstyle now. 
So we're down to eight. Ooh, I see it. Okay, we get a a duration. Oh, okay, I see. They're sending their... Oh, they're coming now. This guy's gonna take forever. Can we not stand on the traps? There we go. Wait, he has a weird... These are ghouls. Uh-oh. Oh, he got me. Three hours. Inhumanization. This person's mind is dominated by the psychic patterns of the void. They are completely disconnected from human concerns of family, friendships, and love. Their experiences of reality is distant and muted, gained by the psychic rhythm of a dark hyper-intelligence. Tough, fast learner. Um, has only how much time left? Three hours. Club her. Uh, let's see here. I'll have Vera. I think she's a doctor, right? Yeah. Let's go ahead and capture this one. I'll take Steve. Oh man, we're running out of time here. Plus beast emerging. Wait. Oh, hell. Okay, we got to get back. Um, animals, I want you to go to designated area two. Where is Benita? Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Damn it. Oh, what the fuck? Pick down one.
Alright, let her get back down. any medicine. Now I'm going to have you rest. Did one get back up? Is that why we had to kill it? I don't want to deal with it getting back up. Looks like that's it. So what happens with this? Bill Pitt? That's very curious. I never seen a pit. That's kind of cool. Whoa, 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 what's going on? <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Okay, who's this guy? Um, oh, he's a builder. Okay, that's cool. I'll have him do research when he's not. I mean, there's nothing I can do about that noise. I guess I could release her. She's gonna die anyways. Here, just tend to her. Yes, Pepper's dead. Wow, that's kind of... Okay, we're going to... Is there an audio? No, it still doesn't. <laughs> right? The Geiger count is going crazy. It's probably UI volume. Yeah, okay, we'll turn that off until... Damn it, they're summoning again. Guys, those attach them now. Oh, 
Oh, there goes Steve. Oh, they're fighting their own creatures. What are they doing? They're going to try summoning one more time. Alright, how bad is Steve? Ah, he's, he'll live. Let's give him his own bed, I guess. Alright, we can put the volume back up. Now there's a prison break. Food poisoning. Ah, oh, Christ. All the times. I mean, if I have to gun them down, I will. Unfortunately, these two have really bad aim. Alright. Four more hours on that. Not letting that go. I guess the dead entities can go here. He just keeps going back and forth. Lost a toe, lost a nose. Shouldn't have defied us. Just a shambler by itself. We'll have another attack coming in eventually.
Why don't you fill this in? Well, I guess this also makes it harder for mountain bases because now they can appear inside the mountains. How good was the check? 59? That's good. Okay, good lead. Let's see here, where's... you know, you need a cook, pal. But what? Why would you put the baby inside with <laughs> abominations? Yep, I knew that was coming. Oh, you can just hit clean barracks and it just does everything. That's cool. Yeah, those are sight stealers entities. It's going to be a long birth. Let's clean up the place. Broke his will. Now we can enslave. Oh, it died and left a shard. But we have that. Hey, Nathan, what's up? Oh, they're still giving birth. My God. Alright, we have another healthy baby. And it's another girl! Well, you know, I see Lucy at the top there. So we're going to name this one Lucy. Welcome to the rim. Yeah, 
We got analogy, or analogy, anomaly. It's been pretty fun to see this new stuff. The first batch of children have been born. Down to one meal now. Oh, food poisoning. Uh, just more shamblers. Wait, what? Chandler Ch Ch Chimera? Oh wait, they have little Chandler rats. Oh, what? Juggernaut serum? I think I'll stay away from that though. Like I have too much going on at the moment. Deserter. Denied. Is this guy tribal? He is. Oh, he is nat nat natural. Oh, yeah, let's get the animals back. They're going to stay over there, right? I like the music that they added. That was Benita's infection. Oh, it's going untreated at the moment. I just noticed that when you hit pause, the music decl you know, lowers down. Then when you unpause, it goes back up. That's, that's a nice little detail. I don't want those animals near that panther. Bonza, you need to work. Get up and cook, man. Our bonsai hasn't put on clothes. Oh, they're just staying down there, though. All right. He's, we beat him up so bad that he's just still on the ground. All right, we're going to... Put you on cleaning duty. But first, I want you to haul stuff. Come on, click it. This is pretty much done. Wait, what? How did she die? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Did I look at that wrong? 
I thought she was fine. Oh, I was looking at the wrong thing. I don't know why I got it backwards. I thought the infection was the 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 immunity. That's why I was like, oh, it was no big problem. Hold on, let me undo that. I <laughs> what the hell was I thinking? Res. I thought she was completely fine this whole time. My bad. One time thing. I'm surprised that the infection went so bad for her, though. Not time, Steve. I'm gonna have to go hunt. You might have to manually hunt, because all that's left is elephants and rhinos. No one's putting this on. It's because it's poor. That's our dog, right? So why is Rosalind outside the designated area? food. I mean, wood. In a shotgun. our farmer's too busy, that's why. Did they leave? Oh, the music stopped. I don't see them. He is not nature. Gonna have to go have people hunt. Let's get Nicola over there too. Where are the elephants? Well, actually, the rhinos are probably safer to hunt. Oh, we got all of them.
finish that, Steve? No, he cannot. Shit. Fuck! This guy didn't hit any traps. Ah, they got him. I thought the rhinos were safer. Let's get everybody back. Guy's just a band-aid at this point. Good one? Okay. People are starving now. all out of here. Should be good on food now. Bridge has been finished. Next, we're just going to add the last bit. Oh, Ross almost had a mental breakdown. I was wondering about that. Oh, the Shambler Swarm is what the secondary attack was. Complex clothing. That'll be fine. 
like that. All the food is up. I think we actually should be making 14 meals. Wait, what? Licinius Mechanoids. Uh, no, thank you. Centipedes? That's all terrible. No. Got an awful one. Okay, let's make another one. What's the skill at crafting now? Five? Building's going. Which wood we got out here? Six hundred? Okay. Gonna be done with that soon. What's Steve's religion, by the way? Strong. F oh, you know what? Cutting the trees down is probably pissing him off. Let's uh, hit him up. Get him to convert. I wonder how much I have to feed these harbingers. Harvest. This guy's still dealing with mechanites. See, how's this tree looking? Why is Steve sleeping with the foxes? Well, he joined... He's not a slave because we actually... He actually joined because he... He was a... Uh, 
he was a wanderer that joined the, the colony, so he didn't come in as a captive. It should be a separate area. It's true. Right now, we don't have the rooms for it, though. We could just put them out here. Let's see here. Might be better. Once we have all the building done, we'll go ahead and capture Steve or imprison Steve and then we'll convert him appropriately. Let's see. Falling tough spike. Time left on these. What's the goal for the series, by the way? Oh man. <laughs> the foxes have always tried to reach a certain. Um... So, the story of the fox, the foxes, and the fox god is that we are to eventually make one of the foxes a God amongst them, like our religion, which means we have to give them all the bionicle parts, all the psychic powers, everything to make them godlike. And once we do that, we can leave the rim. That's that's their purpose. But of course, we're gonna do all the other stuff in between for fun. It's a long process. Especially starting from tribals. I think it's time to start getting ready to butcher these. Looks like we're almost done. Right now, we're slowly just building our defenses. So our bridge of death has been made. So the next thing we do is we're gonna build a wall. Looks like we got quite a bit of granite. We're gonna use those. We don't want people crossing over. Pretty much areas where the crossing is thin. Probably want to close that up. Here, for example, is another possible spot. Oh, and definitely here. Bridge has been finished.
um, she's ready. So let's give Nicola her next power. She's at level 3. Let's see what level 4 gets her. I don't mind the rhino leather disappearing. We have too much of it already. Focus, that's nice. Okay, it's probably someone, yeah, someone's using the bench. That's why she's not researching. Now that we're cleaning up, we're making space in Colleen. All right, if he's going to go dazed, where is he? Let's go ahead and arrest him and convert him already. Oh, he's taking the spare meat. That's fine. Yeah, I don't want to cross that bridge. Move these out of here. We're going to put up a line of defense at the bridge. Let's clear it out. Stones. Oh, that guy is agitated. Right, I'm going to switch this guy to cleaning, because this place needs cleaning.
That was a flu situation. Uh, this time they're looking fine. So I look at the right numbers this time. A lot of vomit to clean in there. Royal Collector. Here I got food poisoning. Probably because the animals are out there, or inside all the day. should help with cleanliness. I don't got anything to give him. That's a solid bridge right there, baby. Rhino meat's disappearing. Look at those boomalopes. Hmm. Are we producing enough rice, though? I think it's time to add a potato farm. You know what, we'll just do corn. Oh, thanks for throwing up right there. How's this going? All right. Oh, he's ready. He's good to go. We used up all the granite. Another quiet day on the rim.
Oh, okay. At least finish that corner. I probably want to finish this too, though. Wait, ornate door? What? That's crazy. That's cool, though. Gonna need more wood, though. Oh no, I just realized we have this over here. We probably don't need to be sweeping this. What's she doing? Wait, what? A marriage ceremony? What? In here? They are getting married in a very unusual spot. Okay, whatever. If it's what works for them, it's fine. Oh, you can't definitely not insult us. We're just insulting the prisoner. Mm. Uh, he's pretty suppressed now. Lost a thumb there. Ooh, lesson learned. Put down a marriage spot. Do they have marriage spots now? Maybe party. Oh wait. Why have I never noticed this before? So I'll mess that up. How's the dog doing on the flu? Yeah, he's doing okay.
Yeah, I definitely need a janitor. Cult escape? A mangling figure is approaching the colony. He wants to talk. You can send a colonist to hear what he has to say. Because he's right there, I suppose. The mangler, mangled stranger stares at you with empty eyes and speaks in a broken voice. He claims to have escaped from a terrible cold and begs to join your colony. He is deeply knowledgeable of all things related to the void. He can study unnatural phenomena faster than others and will also teach others when he gets the chance. He may be very useful, but he also senses there is something Sedarov is not telling you. Hey, Edward. Hmm. We'll think about it. Boy fascination. He's a nudist. That's what he's not telling us. What do you guys think? Should I take him in? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. It's pretty fun. No, not the traps. It's your choice to let uh, take him in or not. Well, yeah, I would just wanted people's opinions. All right, we walled off the areas where the river's short. All right, let's go ahead and accept. Guy has no eyes. Yeah, he has zero sight. Oh my God. Oh, he's definitely not gonna be a doctor. I mean, he likes dark stuff. He said he was he likes uh, studying the Nanali. He has a one in it. What a lie! Very well.
We'll see what nasty disaster he brings with him. We're getting to the point where we're going to need a second cook. Thrombos, nice. He's probably not natural or nature. Yeah, void. There's a meditation called void, huh? much done with all that I'm gonna let them start hauling Out of sight shines. So let's put that up. Was he going to study that? But now we have someone to dedicate to the dark study. Probably should hit him with conversions though. Post justice. 
I'll wait till he's back to town to do that though. Let's see, we're gonna do this forever, but we're going to limit it to here. So he breaks down all stones in that area. Once we have these stones out of the way, we'll put our barricade here so that we can set up to fire upon the enemy when they get here. After meditation, we're going to go hunt. Sidor Rove has had a breakthrough while studying the monolith. He believes the monolith is a conduit for psychic energy connecting to some distant location. However, he is unsure where or what it connects to. Sidor Rove is convinced that by studying more anomalous, anomalous entities, he can find a way to close the conduit or learn to harness its power. The monolith now it provides more knowledge when studied. Ah, oh, that's cool. Yeah, so, after we're done meditating, we're going to go take out the thrombos. And we're done. Thing has a bad back and it's still holding out. Right. <laughs> Hold off on those.
cornfields ready. Alright, looks like we cleared off that. So let's go ahead make some granite. Fair uh, fortification here. There we go. That's an even layout. get damaged? No, they do not. I suppose once they're done, we're going to start digging into the mountain. this guy. Oh, he's over there. He has to be the fox god if he's gonna stay. Alright. Start our first room. Those familiar with my my runs know what this initial area is the storage and cooking and dining rooms. I usually build those first and migrate slowly into the mountain one room at a time, filling the needs as we go. Twisted Obelisk. A mysterious obelisk has crashed nearby. The obelisk hums with putrid psychic energy, gradually uh, intensifying as it approaches some dangerous limit. You can send colonists to suppress the obelisk to prevent it from activating. You can also mark the obelisk for study to try to learn its purpose and perhaps make use of it. You can always attack the obelisk to destroy it, but doing so may unleash unnatural and dangerous phenomena. Wow. <laughs> oh. I mean, that's his whole purpose in this. To research for us. Alright, have we... Yes. Heavy cover.
Devourer attacks. A swarm of huge gape mauled monsters are attacking. These creatures' jaws are massive enough to swallow a human whole. Keep your distance. Oh no. Oh Jesus Christ. Well, fortunately, we have... He's a brawler, so he doesn't like to deal with it. Oh, there's two of them. Here, let's deal with the one trying to cross the river over here. I guess I should put more wall. This guy's going to have to deal with all the traps. Yeah, they're definitely here. Oh my god, they're just going through all the traps. Oh! That thing leaps! You shot it, yeah. <laughs> I mean, the slave is probably the best one to go up front for this. Yeah, you never want to see these things jumping at you. It, oh, it went for his heart. I don't know if we can contain these things yet. Simply because... If I go to research... The containment stuff requires electricity. So we can probably only contain the most feeble of the entities. So we're going to put it down. Well, to study, I have to contain it. I don't think we can contain something this big. But that was, that was exciting. The leap definitely got me off guard. But look, that thing went through one, two, went through nine traps and didn't go down. But we should study. Oh, it doesn't, it's not a study thing. Okay. The sweet mother. What's happened if you butcher them and eat their meat? Yeah, I I don't know. I wonder if you can cook like there's a different type of void meat.
There's dryad meat. Twisted meat. Pieces of twisted muscle and gristle, bloated with tumors and growths. These bizarre shreds of flesh must have come from a horrific creature. Something tells me that's not good to eat. I mean, I'm just taking a hunch here. Throw that in the pile. Let's try for science. No, thanks. Well, I mean, we can use a slave to eat it. Maybe. Oh, how are we here? Ooh, almost time. Quest expires. Pollution clearance. I didn't call seeing that. Wise Bodhisattva Corey Phillips of Dillon Th Treaty has a special request. Someone has dumped an abundance of toxic waste packs near one of her settlements and she is unable to safely store them. If you accept, Cory will deliver 238 toxic waste packs by transport pod. Not kept frozen, blah blah blah. We can get a primitive great bow volume one. This warp schematic stores blueprints focus on great bows. Crafting great bows with these designs in is complicated by contradictory annotations, but it is still full of wisdom for learners. Oh, do you learn how to... Is that how you learn? Because re we don't have great bows. Is that just... I don't know. Investigation of the obelisk has revealed some information. It is an archotechnological device that seems to ex interact with organic creatures at a distance. It is probably a piece of a much larger archotech structure that was destroyed or broken apart long ago. The machinery in its core is inhumanly complex and frightfully powerful. Its purpose and method of action remains totally mysterious. If not suppressed, its activ activity level will increase over time. You can't tell. What will happen when the device fully activates? Oh man. So how do I... Studying Twisted Obelisk. Yeah, we gotta... Let's try to keep it suppressed. We got a guy specifically for that, right? Yeah, he's getting a little hard time keeping up with the cooking. I'm just going. We might not have enough wood for all those traps. We have reached search draw animals. So draw animals allows us to perform a psychic ritual which will draw a herd of animals. Summon flesh beast. Ooh. Perform a psychic ritual which provides flesh beasts to emerge from the ground near enemies. That sounds cool. Let's do that. 
Oh, we actually have advanced ones, too. other quest. Oh yeah, the pollution. Nerve spiker. What? A crossbow-like device that throws rough spikes embedded with a paralytic, paralytic biotoxic. Low damage, but it stuns non-mechanical targets. Large targets are more resistant to the biotoxin and will be stunned for less time. Hmm, that sounds cool. I don't know if I want to put pollution on my tile just for that. We got on this. When's the last time you've been attacked? That was an attack. Devour assault. Oh, that was the marriage. I think it's <laughs> like, get me out of here. Fire creativity, Benita. Let's see, Benita. Oh, I gotta fix this. She's a red fox, right? Oh yeah, we're ready for our next second power, level 5. Bar skip, that's a nice one. Alright, we finished with those. Let's see, production, tailor, bench. We're gonna make some thrombo. What's it called? Coats. Let's see here. Dusters.
There we go. What should we got? 200. So we can make at least two of those. a lot of stones. Ooh, we're out of rice? Wow. Yeah, we definitely needed more food coming in. Let's add a, another field of rice to help make up for... Because that cornfield is not going to be ready anytime soon. Gonna have to do simple meals. How much time is that? Like? Fourteen hours. Jesus. Then I better start cooking while we still have time. Hit this guy with the converts. I guess we're going after those elephants next. want to build a wall here too. Shaman? Merchant. That's good. We can use a shaman. Yeah, we definitely need a hunt already. Well, we hunt in a group now. Let's do it now while people aren't hungry. Where are these elephants? OK, 
pit barrel collapse. Oh. That. Forgot all about that. Just in case you're crazy on us. Why do I miss running gun? Why I put it that close? Well, that's a whole lot of meat to eat. I guess we'll just do fine carnivorous meals for now. Until we have enough rice to supplement regular fine meals. Oh yeah, let's trade with them. Usually you have like a shock lance or something. Vanity lance? Fine. Let's see here. Anything else? Pulsers? Soothers? Nothing special. But we don't have the money. That's the problem. Ah, uh, okay, never mind. Put our first wall torch. Can only put it on the north and south walls. That's kind of interesting. Oh, there we go. You have to hit W or E, or Q or E, rather. Psychic Droning. Have you played with Hospitality Mod? I have not. 
I don't know if it's gonna be, I doubt it will be working now though. So let's see here, a machine persona in the in an orbital ship wants to perform some planetary experiments hovering however, if she carries out her experiment, a medium psychic drone will buzz the area around the Valley of Gods for six point seven days, pushing all people of the female gender towards insanity. Mm, that's our main gender, so I'll probably pass. Like, yeah, but some some mods that I didn't expect to break broke in weird ways too. So it has snapped. Can no longer tolerate holding such dangerous entities in captivity and tend to destroy them as many as he can. Well, alright. We only needed one of those anyways. That happened fast too. Top down too, huh? Oh yeah, let's go ahead. Where's the slave collars? I really don't want them making out a throne bow. Probably watch him. Oh, he's fine now. Dang. Did they make lightning different? It looks a little different. Looks like we got that back. Do five meals now. Obelisk mutation. While interacting with the obelisk, Vera felt a sudden sharp pain in her stomach as her tissue began to roil and mutate. Her stomach has mu mutated mutated into a mass of semi-sentient flesh. The harsh acids it produces are painful but prevent food poisoning. What? <laughs> flesh mass stomach. But she has to live in pain for the rest of her life. You probably, I guess you can like remove it. Maybe dangerous to remove. You know what? I think 
I don't want my foxes messing with that thing. Surprised it's not raining yet. Does you have yep those rare times where it actually comes important or useful I wouldn't even say important Definitely got to keep it away from the wood. I don't even want you to care about this area. Stone isn't important. I do want you to actually fix it though. If it gets damaged. There we go, there's the the rain. Panther didn't even get hit. I'm down to the last few hours. Oh, we got some steel here. finished. You learn more about the obelisk 
It is an Arcotech machine that transforms flesh creatures into different forms. The device is damaged, so the new forms would be chaotic and unstable. A person or animal so transformed would become something totally unrecognizable. The obelisk's energy level rises unless suppressed. If it fully activates, it could transform an endless number of creatures, creating a nightmarish horde of flesh mutants. Sodorov thinks that it may be possible to safely shut down the obelisk, but this will need significantly more study. You can now intentionally provoke a response from the twisted obelisk. Really? Oh my god. I don't know if I... I'm gonna have you move all stuff. See here, we're gonna go with marble. Go ahead and chop those up. Did you know the Great Bow does more damage than a charge rifle? No, I did not. Ne never made that uh, distinction before. That's an interesting co uh, concept. I guess it gives... Uh, natives a chance party time Slowly getting this guy down. Masterwork. Fancy. Oh yeah, bookcases. I wonder if bookcases will help students. Let's see. Lucy and Cryptia are age one.
Ah, there we go. This is gonna make everything out of marble. If I can, anyways. Took the meat out of there? We're gonna start smoothing. Still working on smithing. You know what? I need to get growing out of there. Let her focus mostly on researching now. Summon flesh beasts. Perform a psychic ritual which provokes flesh beasts to emerge from the ground near enemies. Attack anybody nearby. So what does that require? Two hours. Oh, that's cool. I kind of like the chronophagy, which lets you steal the youth from someone to give it to themselves. So let's go ahead and do this one. Psychophagy. Perform a psychic ritual which deadens a target's psychic sensitivity and temporarily boosts the ritual invoker's psychic sensitivity. The target will suffer brain damage as a side effect. Well, I really want to get chronophagy, so that's the goal. Monothus study progress. Sidorov has Sidorov made progress studying the monolith. The structure connects normal space to the void, a dimensional a dimension hidden in the structure of space-time. Some powerful mind in the void is leaking influence into our reality. Sidorov wants to study the monolith further to learn more. The monolith now provides more knowledge when studied. Let's go ahead and hunt the alpacas. It's been a while since we've been attacked, huh? 36. It's almost been... It's been seven days, it looks like.
the robber camp. The High Chief of Trogo Confederation has sent us a message. Apparently out outlanders based in the nearby camp have been raiding their caravans. The camp is controlled by Federation of Kara. Heron is asking to destroy the camp. Yada yada. The musing of suit. A standardized trade book on experimentation. It takes you through the subject step by step. According to the back flap, Axe Suit, track, uh, Zrax Kill, was blind from birth, so never saw her book. The Duchess of Ranamo, Ranoma, Ranomi sponsored this book with the condition that it be freely available. This textbook has been seen better days, but the pages are decent, if slightly scored. Intellectual and cooking. Interesting. You're not quite in the position to leave the colony, though. How's our wealth looking? Ooh, it's starting to climb. Go ahead and up side shite. Pause stone add to the colony wealth. You mean the stone blocks? Well, it's definitely item wealth that's going up. Yeah, item wealth. What happened here that caused the jump up? Is this the thrombos? We had higher wealth before, actually. Well, actually, just in regards to item. Overall, our wealth is higher than ever before. But now we can send flesh minions at people. What happens if you chop them down? Definitely not beautiful.
When you smooth the stone, the wealth will go up. Just about everything you have on the map can make wealth go up on Windworld. Yeah, I'm familiar with that. I'm trying to keep our mood at highest. As we go along. Plus I'm going to have to smooth the walls too so we can get electricity going through here. When we can. Move it over there. Combat supplier. We still don't have much gold though. Let's see here. Still have plenty of marble. Shambler assault. A horde of 38 shamblers is approaching. Some unnatural force is animating these lifeless corpses. They are intent on attacking your colonies. As they exhaust their en strange energy, they will begin to collapse within hours. Oh man. I don't think the traps are going to survive this. Good thing we have a combat. So oh, of course, the traps get destroyed. That's annoying. Let's see what they do. Looks like they're going to cross the river. I think we should at least intercept them. Really? I get sh struck by lightning too? Come on, Cassandra. This is bullshit. Oh my god. Well, so much for Hyde Helm. Or Fred Helm. I shot him. <laughs> I gotta be careful here. I don't want to shoot them in the crossfire.
Oh boy, they're dying. Oh no, the fucks! And he just stands there. That's great. Oh, they don't respond to that. Then can someone shoot him? Why is there so many? I think we just got the crossover the river. Oh, they're after the dogs. best thing I can do with psychic powers is to hit them with focus. Oh god, it's crawling! Okay, get you. Now they're destroying my traps that sound oh boy <laughs> everywhere No, the fox! That sucks. They went straight for the animals. What was that sound? Oh, there's one still alive. Well, I don't know why I put them on that. But we're going to have to go to hauling. Yeah, let's do that. What's the situation?
Guess we want to get him inside. Actually, we just use this one. Really? Oh, the dog. Can we get these out of here? Heavy SMGs? Well, they definitely changed the look on some of these. Hellcat rifle. Fortunately, it's bow coated. Dang, even with poor. I'm going with that. Heavy SMG. Oh, they broke the stone door, too. Got a lot of building to redo. He said these are the children alone. That's fine. Let's preach health to him. Trees ready. Advanced psychic rituals. Nice. Uh, Philophagy. Perform a psychic ritual that drains experience from a victim and gives it to the invoker. The process will dull the target's mind, weakening their skills and causing brain damage. Then we don't know what these are. Can't research it until... 
Yeah, okay. Electricity's holding us back. Yeah, let's go ahead and give him actual medicine for this. This thing was about to die. Let's go ahead and get her last psychic power. Cat Neuroquake Shambler's away, I, I think. Oh no, these are rotting. Berserker Pulse, nice. Oh, it rotted. I also collect the guns. Is he not in bed? He should be. Hold on. Who the hell is it? It's way out there. I don't want to deal with him. Alright, anyway, take it easy. Okay, what's up with this? Stop it. Did he piss all of them off? Excuse me. That should help with the temperature. Oh, viral ferrites. Oh, he's immune now. Okay.
<laughs> Look at that. They're getting well fed now. Okay, pal, you need to cook. You know, you don't have a place for rotten animals to be discarded. Oh, well that was quick. This is about to expire. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna leave the colony anytime soon. Gonna need to clean a bit. Alright, time for chronophagy. Let's see, the kids are still one years old. destroyed some of that. Alright, traps are nearly finished, smithing is ready, let's go plate armor. Let's get some smithing done.
Looks like we're done with that. Wait, we're still researching? Oh no, he must be suppressing it. Yeah, that's what he's doing. She's uh, oh, she was hunting and she went back. And it's steel. Oh, we're definitely gonna, definitely gonna have to mine this. Finish that. Mm. Obelisk mutation. While interacting with the obelisk, Bonsai observed a sudden pulse of energy. The obelisk has twisted a nearby tree into a harbinger tree. These monstrous trees are capable of feeding on nearby corpses and raw meat. We already have plenty of these though. Anything worthwhile? Meh, not really. Monolith study complete. 
Fedorov has completed the study of the monolith. The structure is a conduit that links to the void, a reality hidden under every point in space-time. The void is inhabited by a vast machine intelligence of terrifying complexity that surges with nightmarish inhuman rage. Its influence creates horrors in our world. Awakening the monolith will fully open the conduit. With the channel open, Sedorov believes he could reach through the link to permanently close the conduit or find a way to harness its dark powers. The monolith now provides more knowledge when studied. Oh, fun. Oh boy. Attunement. Oh, that was a Chimera. We just saw the undead version of it. Faunus for a refugee empire. My numb serum. Ask the lender two colonists for nine days. I won't give out colonists. Someone finally got up. Yeah, we probably should start making helmets. Shaman Merchant. All right. Mm, we're down to eighty seven wood. Let's go ahead and see what these guys have to offer. Hopefully we have money to do something. Another insanity lance. A serum of clear vicious fluid injected near the brainstem. It deadens the mind, rendering the user unable to feel the highs and lows of human emotion temporarily prevents them from having mental breakdowns and inspirations. Interesting. Looks like we're finished smoothing the floors. Oh, actually, we have one more right there. Down to four hours. I'm just gonna go ahead and chop these. Dang it.
Got another marriage. Let's move these over to get turn into stone chunks. Or blocks. see here. Nicola maxed out. Now it leaves it to would be the next candidate. Looks like it's going to be Benita. in here. Looks like we found the end of it. Damn, that was quick making the helmets. Alright, we finally upgraded our war masks to steel helmets. We're almost a year in and we haven't even seen a mechanoid yet. That's curious. We're 
Oh man, he didn't cook this whole time. That food's already gone. Bro. Mysterious cargo. Hi, Stella Art. Zoe Lemus of the Refugee Empire has an odd request. She would like you to accept some unspecific cargo. When pressed for more details, she avoided the question. There is desperation in her voice. I think we know what that cargo is going to be. But I'm curious about these books. So we're going to accept. All right. So Chrono Feiji has been researched. We can go ahead and get the advanced research there. And let's get the Dark Shambler summon as well. I think we need to get food on the table first before we accept anything. Mm. Are all the rhinos together? No, they're separate. You know what, let's just hunt down the rhinos. Lots of meat, real quick to deal with. I got Berserker Pulse. I don't need to hunt. Is that it? Not quite what I was hoping for. Hey, Edwin! There. And they can kill each other. This one's losing for sure. I will get food soon. Vein. What? Designate an area of rock. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, that's cool. There we got the rhino. Sorry, you don't get to sleep. hard to take that guy down.
No, I didn't capture all of them yet. I mean, we still got a lot to uncover. Oh yeah, um, well we'll wait till morning, deal with this mysterious cargo. Let's see what this book is, Tetranet's Toughness, or Togetherness. In the well-written epic poem, the unnamed author captures the saga of her experience fighting against centipedes. It is interesting and engaging, but the characters are trite and cartoonish. It's unclear exactly what book, what when the book was written. Recreation game multiplier, nice. The last one is funny. It's like Toxic Fallout. Really? I figured it was going to be like some sort of. Uh, I think it's time to get into electricity. Storm because. Or at least, I think this one's a storm of some sort. Or maybe this is what you're talking about. Both of these look like a type of storm. Alright, let's go ahead and accept. Really, food binge right now. Wait, is that it? Capturable. The spine. Oh, whoa. After friend Heim chained the Revenant's spine to a holding platform, the Revenant reemerged. When killed, a Revenant's body dissolves, leaving behind only its architectural spine. This cage of slick iron waits for a chance to grow a new body. discover the Revenant has yielded new insights, you can now research the following anomo anomaly projects. Revenant Invisibility and Brain Wipe. Oh, it's over here. Skip abduction. We could do skip abduction. Pods arrived. They just throw the book in the water, huh? Oh yeah, we got plate armor done, so... Oh, we don't have the skill. What's your skill at? Six! Oh, it's one point away. Yeah, yeah. 
We have enough for some dusters, though. Fuck. How to get the corn, huh? I know. Elephant. Oh, it got the whole fucking crop. Uh. That's bullshit. How far was it? It was at 90%. Oh, that is such bullshit. I've never seen it take the whole a crop that big before. I mean, we're not hurting for food at the moment, but still. The fuck? Brain wipe allows you to recruit unwavering loyal prisoners, I think. Well, that's good. They needed a way to fix that. I found that obnoxious. going to use the steel for armor, but I guess not. How far is he from it? Oh, he's not far. Making that one piece of duster should be enough to get plate armor. Usually when they escape, they, uh, fight their way out. Huh. Okay. Oh shit. Oh my god, what is it doing to him? Hit 
hypnotized. Revenant flush chunk. A strip of leathery, desiccated flesh that slothed off a revenant when it was harmed. The tissue oozes a dark, oily liquid. Sidorov has been hypnotized by the revenant and is now rambling incoherently about nightmarish images and ideas. Killing the revenant will end the hy hy hypnosis. The revenant uses psychic powers to twist the perceptions of those around it, making itself invisible. However, it can still be hunted by falling black smears of its that it leaves. The revenant will be revealed if hit by explosive weapons, fire from EMP, fire, or disruptor flares. If not killed, the revenant will continue to hypnotize new victims. Well, this sucks. I don't have any way to stop that. Invisible enemies is definitely crazy. I wonder if I can berserk it, force it to fight me. How to track it, okay. Nikola has finished analyzing the Revenant's flesh chunk with biosignatures Infisrona uh, M9. She learned more about this particular Revenant's bio biology and how to identify fluids it leaves behind. This Revenant will now leave a much larger trail of visible smudges when it flees. Perhaps you'll be able to find it and kill it while it sleeps can track it by smears it leaves behind and reveal it will will disrupt flares explosive EMPs and fire I have no way to start fires if it only comes at night.
smooth terrain doesn't affect the walls anymore. It made it its own thing. Interesting. Got to keep it suppressed. Oh, nice you have the obelisk. Yeah. I do. Expect an attack soon. Oh, Christ. Holy hell, why so many rats? Well, there goes all the traps. Expecting it to show up. Only two of them got here, which is weird. Oh, the Shambler must have destroyed the rats. Still nothing. Hmm. Like it over there.
okay. Gonna mess this up, pal. Get the rats. You need a cook. Where are you? God damn you. Guys still didn't cook enough. Is that a good trader? That could be good. I wonder if they'll hit traders. They can buy books from these guys. Formal apparel. Book of Harris. Into break chance, 2.5%. It, in this well-organized inquiry, an elderic investigator unfolds his brutal experiments on a captured beautiful golden cube that destroys minds. One chapter describes a theory wherein a distant hyper-intelligence can psychically manipulate human co cognition, reshaping a person's thoughts to align with its own mind patterns. The book is, un is useful, but often too concerned with the author's own personal interests. Huh. I think we have, oh, that's the one we have. Decker's perspectives on shooting. That sounds useful. We can sell these off. They have a doomsday rocket, that's nice. Let's go ahead and get the other book, too. You know, I should have bought the cat. Good for XP. Oh, Benina's pregnant yet again. Surprised we haven't countered it again. Just sacrifice skipped. Oh, that's the other guy's religion.
I was wondering if it would attack. I left an SMG, some flesh. Chase it down. Now it's getting away. Oh, we got him. Still going. Yeah, we really need a way to hunt this guy. He got shot up a lot and still got away. Mm. I guess we got another SMG though. Left. Oh, I see. But without fire, I don't know what we can do. Berserk only seems to like wake him up or something. We definitely can't fight this guy head on. Oh, not again. While interacting with the obelisk, Vera observes a sudden spike in energy. The obelisk has violently warped the flesh of a monkey, turning into a hideous flesh beast. What? <laughs> that monkey. Ugh. Well, let's see if they have anything I can buy. Where's their leader? There he is. Quest. Oh, that's... Uh, you can capture it. Well, I don't like it escaping. We had it captured. That's how we ended up with it. Damn it, they don't have weapons I can use for this. A <laughs> doomsday rocket might be the only other choice. This is bad. The monkey's flesh turned inside out. Right on clipboard. Noted. <laughs> yeah, yep. Yeah, that's uh, another thing. I put it in the logs.
but it has to heal for a while too. But if we couldn't stop it, I don't know what we can do. Like if a an arsenal of a caravan couldn't put this thing down, like I'm effed without a way to keep chasing it. Okay, we need we need something here. Fortunately, great bows aren't gonna help me with anything. There's like nothing I can research directly that can give me what I need. I have to get electricity and go into machine. Molotov cocktail, maybe? They're fragile and heal like ghouls. Oh, well, they're healing quite... Oh, the flesh beasts. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Finger spike. It's a shame that the traps don't work on it either. Grenades might be the other other choice too. They're gonna take their friend. Nope. Man, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I have to get lucky enough to um, to burden it so that I can keep it in range to shoot at it, keep it from phasing out. But you saw how quick it got out. This guy died. Oh, he died. How did he die? A oh, panther got him. Oh, well, that would do it. Capable. I finished analyzing the Revenant's flesh chunk. Learn more, blah blah blah. Colonists can hear it. If you go hunting the Revenant and get close, you'll be notified which colonists can hear it. Perhaps you'll be able to find it if you kill it while it sleeps. Track it by smears and leaves behind, and reveals its flares, explosions, EMPs, and fire. If only I can find a way to cause fire. He hears it. So it's around there.
the other choice is to leave the colony. <laughs> you know? Like, this place is haunted. Oh, yeah, let's go ahead give Benita her power. If she gets burdened too, then that will help us slow it down even easier. Another burden. Nice. So the chances are catching it with a burden is twice as likely. But what do I how would I get it to reveal itself, Pharaoh? That's the problem. The game doesn't give me a way to uh, start a fire. Let's get the get the rhinos. I'm I'm guessing it only comes out at night. I'm hoping it only comes out at night. And that way I can predict it. Might be right here. I'll wait till it collapses. Biggest issue is food right now. Too many mouths to feed. Only one person to cook. Someone took their jacket off. Okay, he's putting it on. I still healing.
nothing yet. Sunblocker for pay. Till I destroy it. Secrets of the Cube, legendary. Damn. Death refusal. Oh, we should pass by it again. Yeah, until we have stronger containments, I don't think we should try to try to hold the revenants. See if something happens tonight. I'm gonna move Steve inside. Children are now two. It did get shot up pretty good, so chances are it needs to rest for one more day at least. Oh, for fuck's sake, I don't need this shit. Oh my god! Four peep, five people out. That's not what I need to see. He's already out. That makes that easy.
Okay, so it does attack during the day too. Dog. Okay, that doesn't do anything. Do we get it with the burden? No, come on. Bullshit. Like, I'm sacrificing my slaves. Love the cube, cherish the cube, but really, you should prioritize food first. Well, thank you. We just shoot in the direction that I can see it moving about. Got him! Oh, come on! track of him. <sighs> That's another one. You can't attack directly. There's nothing to target. Nicola has finished analyzing the Revenant's flesh chunk with biosignatures. Uh, Infes, Infes Rona 9, uh, M9. She has learned more about the specific Revenant's biology and its method of hiding from sight. Connors can now see the, this Revenant when it is nearby. Perhaps you'll be able to... Okay, we did it. We finally got to the point where we can just hunt this thing down. with the wrong person, pal. Oh, 
I don't see any marks. Wait, wait. What's this? Where? You probably get out of the way there. Oh, because he's too close. Gotcha. He can't get away now. God dang this thing. It's getting faster. Where did it go? We can hear it. Damn, this thing is sturdy. God dang! Turn it damage to the whoa! Oh sweet God! Revenant seen, Revenant killed. The Revenant is dead. Those who were hypnotized will recover. Its body has dissolved, leaving behind its spine. You can gather and study the spine, or destroy it. <laughs> I like they put all that animation into it. Oh, man. Well, now, okay. There is a plus side to this. That we have analyzed it so much that should it get released again... You should be able to hunt it down with ease. The unfortunate thing is, is that we don't have the research necessary to contain it for a long period of time, it seems. Like, it can stay for maybe a day or two, but then it gets gets away. We'll try it one more time. We'll see how that works out. But, but it's good to note that after three studies, you can just start hunting it down if you don't have, like, the appropriate weaponry. I can't get better research containment until electricity. Because to get the entity containment, 
it's a request uh, prerequisite. So there's that. Disruptive flares, yeah. Proximity detectors, electro harvesters. So that's what's keeping us from doing that. And we're currently researching it, but electricity is a long way to go for tribals. Okay, yeah. I think now that we have his number down, he can't cause too much problems anymore. Alright. I think that it's a good spot to end it at. It's a very interesting <laughs> like little hunting thing going on. That was pretty cool. Uh, we'll call it here for today. Maybe we'll play some tomorrow. Or maybe we'll hold off to Monday. And continue on our regular schedule but anyways you have a great night guys hope you have a great weekend i'll see you next time farewell and always be wary of the dark all right guys good night